Underlying my teaching philosophy is the idea that all of our tawira come to us with whakapapa, with tribal histories and with an innate ability to reach the heights of their desired goals and so my role as an educator is to facilitate that process so that our tawira can actualise their goals and aspirations in a way that is consistent with tikanga Māori and mātauranga Māori. Amongst other things, I want to demonstrate aspects of Rangatiratanga. She is a great leader of our reo, of Te Reo Māori, um, but also of Te Ao Māori. She always respects and empowers what Tawira have to say, um, what I have to say as well, but at the same time she also challenges our opinions um, to make us think critically in our research and in our mahi. She is constantly thinking about improving her teaching. Uh, she's aware of uh, the way that she communicates and asks for feedback from students and, and the things that they've understood from the way that she's communicated. The way that I teach is very intentional, so I take a lot of pride and a lot of time to think about the way that I've designed not only the course as a whole, but each individual lesson has a specific learning target outcome. She's very clear about her teaching and in the feedback process uh, is able to draw from what the students know and the experience they bring into the classroom. Through processes of colonisation, um, our students come to us with a very diverse range of experiences and so part of my role is creating space for all of those experiences to be valued and recognised um, so that those students feel that, that their experiences are valid. I'm a big fan of creating role plays and scenario based learning as well as including practical experiences that students can demonstrate some of the skills that they have that may not be written. Dr Tahuya would always um, whakamana the mahi of her students um, and if you asked her a question she would never, and maybe she didn't agree, she would never put you down but she would always take your thinking to the next level. It's very important to me that I create environments um, that are conducive to allowing our students to express themselves in their fullest um, expression of emotions and so there are multiple components to the way that I teach and the ways that I try and engage our students so that they have a sustained enjoyment and engagement in that learning experience particularly when we're discussing things that are sensitive or very culturally emotionally laden. So that includes um, making sure that whanaungatanga and manakitanga um, of those experiences is at the forefront. Mm -hmm.